So everybody knows about the Swiss K31 sniper rifle in Black Ops Cold War, and you may think you know the best class for it in 2022 if you are still playing this game. But I've been doing some experimenting, and I think I may have found the newest and best class setup for this sniper rifle. I'll get into the class setup a little bit later on in this video, but first I want to show you guys some of my absolute best clips and highlights with this class. Oh my god. Okay, after this game. Okay. Go! Six on! Oh my god. Holy f Yeah. Let's see. Go! Oh my god. Oh my god, I just hit a fucking five on. Holy shit, bro. Yeah, I, I for some reason I think that like caffeine hits instantly, which it, like doesn't. It'll oh, hit. it'll hit! It's hitting! Oh yeah! It's fucking hitting! Kill chain. No way, you put a sentry gun there. Go! I can't, the sentry! So am I. JSDGs, you should literally use in a Swiss. Go live right now, bro. I can't, bro. Go again, go again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nice. Damn, bruh. Alright guys, here we are. I'm going to be giving you the best Swiss K31 class setup in Black Ops Cold War. This is the updated setup that I was talking about at the beginning of the video. And this is also the class setup I was using for all those clips you guys just saw. So on my first Swiss K31, we have the Tiger Team Barrel, Tiger Team Spotlight, Bruiser Grip, 7 round speed mag. This attachment is what makes this class so good. I love having the 7 round speed mag. Those quick reloads are so crucial, especially if you're playing fast paced game modes like 12v12 Mosh Pit. And I also have the Serpent Wrap. Just a quick disclaimer. Disclaimer, I usually run no stock, but as we can see here, it takes off the variant off the body of the gun and I don't like that. So I was just running the default stock 
instead of no stock but usually i am running no stock so the only downside of this class is that you cannot run a body so you can't run tiger team spotlight which i thought was kind of a big deal when i first started using this class but eventually you just get used to it and on my second swiss we have the tiger team barrel bruiser grip seven round speed mag serpent wrap and raider stock so the only downside of this class is that you cannot run a body so you can't run tiger team spotlight which i thought was kind of a big deal when i first started using this class but eventually you just get used to it trust me guys this class is super fun it is so fast having that speed mag makes it really feel like you're in the action so much with this gun so try out this class let me know what you think i'd love to hear from you guys in the comments so that's going to be it for the video guys thank you so much for watching it all the way through make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you're new we're absolutely grinding cold war i'm going to be streaming by the time you see this video so click that link in the description man come through to the stream say what's up i hope you guys enjoyed the video and have a great rest of your day take care everybody